The AMX-30 is a main battle tank designed by Isiles Molinos Construction Workshops, France. Developed in the late 1950s, for the armament needs of the French Army. The first prototype was built in 1960 and entered service with the French Army in 1967. The production of the MBT was put into service by the 503rd Tank Regiment operating at Mormelon, followed by the 501st Regiment at Rambouillet, as part of the French Army's arsenal. In early 1980, approximately 1,210 AMX-30s were in combined operations with 1,010 AMX-13s, and as of January 1, 1989, a total of 1,258 AMX-30s were in service with the French Army. The AMX-30 has a gun turret and hull. Its development focused on firepower and mobility rather than protection. The crew consists of four people namely commander, gunner, gun loader and pilot, as well as driver. Vehicles are equipped with NBC, nuclear, biological, and chemical protection, protection, and an automatic fire suppression system. The tank's armor is very thin and can only protect against small guns and artillery splinters, which are penetrated by all today's modern anti-tank weapons. The main armament of the AMX-30 is the giant CN-105F1, with a caliber of 105mm, and is capable of firing kinetic energy penetrator, HE, heat, and HEF RAG rounds, as well as incendiary, smoke, and illumination rounds. The AMX-30's effective firing range only has a radius of about 1,800 meters. Secondary armament consists of a coaxial 20mm automatic cannon, characteristically able to be aimed at altitude independently of the main gun to function as an anti-aircraft light, and a 7.62mm machine gun, mounted to a projector, can accept an infrared filter for night vision. On the turret and controlled from the inside by the tank commander, The French tank is powered by a Hispano Suiza HS-110 multi-fuel diesel engine, has 720 horsepower and is equipped with a deep wading kit and can wade through water up to 4 meters deep.